Hey parents, we are going to be doing a lot of activities and assignments on Canvas this year, so I just want to make a video to explain how to log into Canvas from home. So first you're going to need to go to freedomprep.instructure.com freedomprep.instructure.com I would bookmark this page because your kids will be going to this website quite a bit. Once you go to freedomprep.instructure.com, it will bring up a page that looks like this. You will need to log in. Your child is the one that needs to log in. They, obviously this is the website right here, their username is their first initial and their whole entire last name, followed by their graduation year. So if they're in third grade this year, it's 2030, and then at freedomprep.net. So if we have John Smith, it would be J Smith 2030 at freedomprep.net. Their password is capital F, lowercase p-a, colon, lunch number. You can pause the video right here and figure out your student's information and try to log in if you'd like. Uh, this is the example, capital F, p-a, colon, their lunch number. Uh, the, the F must be capitalized or it won't work. That's the biggest mistake that we see. So once they've logged in, you, they will come to a page that looks like this. It'll go to their dashboard where they have announcements, but also um, they'll just have other things from different classes that they're enrolled in. Most likely your student is just enrolled in one class. Um, so if they go to courses, I have a bunch of classes, but your student should just have one. It'll say Miss Moon. If they're in my class, it might say Bushman Language Arts. If they're in Mrs. Bushman's class, it, just have them click on whatever class that your student's in that your student is in, and it will take them to a home page. There are two things that we need to know in Canvas. One, the home page is where you can access all of the links. Aspire is where you can check your students' grades. Homework is where you will, if you click on that, it will take you directly to all of the homework assignments that we have. These have the spelling words on them, as well as uh, where you initial if your student has read. So if you your student loses this, you can print it off from here. So that's the homework tab. It also has Typing Club, Lexia, Dreambox, AR. These are all websites that we use. So instead of sending out a million different websites, we figured we'd just put them all on Canvas, explain how to get on Canvas, and then you have them all here. And this, again, is in the home page. Once you click on courses and your student's teacher, it should go right here to the home page. The second thing that your student needs to be able to navigate through in Canvas is modules. So if you'll click modules on the side, this is where their assignments and quizzes and things like that will be on Canvas. So if your child is gone, we'll send a document that explains the different things that they'll be missing, and most likely they'll be missing a Canvas quiz or something like that. As you can see, we had a reading module one the second week of school uh, with declarative and interrogative and different types of sentences. Um, this third week of school, we have main idea. That was what our reading module is. So your student can scroll th through these. When we're done with something, I will unpublish it. So your student won't be able to see that. This module we're done with, I've unpublished it. So it shows up on mine, but it won't show up on your students. So really, if they go to modules, there'll only be a couple things there that they can look at. And you'll have reading quizzes, most likely. Eureka math modules, if they miss lesson seven, this has the lesson practice and the homework. Um, and then the daily language review is the grammar that we do at the beginning of every day and it's by weeks. So this is where all the information will be. Just wanted to explain how to find things on Canvas. Again, you can shoot me an email if you have a question or you need help, but this video hopefully will explain how to find everything on the homepage and how to navigate the modules tab in Canvas. Good luck.